Well, our communal effort to return to normal is taking a couple of steps forward this Sunday, the last Sunday in September. The lights return to the Cultural District tonight and the Great Race return to the streets and Point State Park today. Let's start in the Cultural District with Jessica Gway and the return to the footlights with some precautions. Yeah, John, anyone who wants to see the Mavericks perform here at Byam Theater tonight will need to bring a few items with them. There's a big sign with the requirements right at the entrance, so you'll need your ticket, of course, a valid ID, a vaccination card, and a mask. Keep in mind that all Pittsburgh's cultural arts organizations are going to require proof of vaccinations for indoor performances. There are exceptions, guests under 12 and those with medical or religious exemptions but they must show a negative COVID test. Masks are also required when Allegheny County has a substantial or high COVID-19 transmission. Right now, transmission is still high. The return of live performances is creating a sense of normalcy in the cultural district. Safety is just paramount because it's been 18 months and we have been waiting this whole time for our theaters to come back online. Now that they're coming open again, we don't want to see the theaters close. So we're putting all these safety protocols in place to ensure that everyone is safe. Now, if you don't want to bring your COVID vaccination card with you, you are allowed to show a picture of it on your cell phone if that's what you prefer. Doors are opening here at 7. You can see people already lined up, ready to go in. And the Mavericks take the stage at 8. Live in the Cultural District, Jessica Gway, KDKA News.